Dean, a matchbox is five centimetres long. Are you happy with that? Yes, I can see that. Right. It gives us a problem, though. And that's how to drop a matchbox from its own height of five centimetres mm -hmm. and have it land and stay on its end. I bet you can't. Uh, I might be able to, but I think I'll have to do it very carefully. Very carefully. Okay. okay. Just five centimetres. Don't mm -hmm. make it hard. It bounces. Yeah. Yeah. You no, might fluke one, but... Uh... Can I hold it any way I like? Yeah, sure. All right, I'll try putting my fingers underneath it. And then quickly... No, that didn't help at all. Uh, what if I build in a sort of shock absorber? That by, sounds a good uh, idea. Um, opening the tray a little bit. Uh, I think that's better. Yeah, it doesn't bounce as much, does it? No. I think I'm getting closer, but the matches are sort of getting in the way and coming out. What if I put the shock absorber now you're really this warm. end? Okay. Five centimetres? Mm-hmm. Got it. Ah, works! <laughs> Amazing! Yeah, the drawer slams. That takes a lot of the energy that otherwise is bounce. Great well, trick. really, that's, I mean, that's easy, isn't it? Well, Here's a smart. harder one. Here's a harder one. Take a one-cent coin, same height, five centimetres. Yes. How can you drop that so it lands and stays on its edge? Oh, that's impossible. No, Not no, a coin. coin. Hmm? Oh, if you had plasticine and no, dropped it Whatever you've got that. on the table, nothing else. Oh, let me try. No. Ridiculous. Got It'll him. It'll never work. Got him this time. And in case it's got you too, we'll come back at the end of the programme and show you how it's done. Rob, that's absolutely impossible. There's no way I can drop a one cent coin from a height of five centimetres or any other height and yes, make it stand on its edge. Yes, there is. Can't be done. Well, you leave it alone and I'll show you how. See, you can use whatever you've got on the table. Okay? Right. One of those things, because I put it there, is a bottle. Oh. And it happens to have some water in it, which I also give away. Well. I have to take a bit of care here, but if you pour some of the water out mm -hmm. and wet the side of the bottle, yes. and also wet the coin, mm -hmm. you've got two wet surfaces and they're going to stick together, okay? Oh, right there. I see. Let the coin go, about five centimetres. Let him go yes. and... Amazing. on side. Mm. And you can experiment at home. You'll need a bottle with a straight side. You can see how good you can get and what height you can drop it from and have it still stand on its side. And also try it with larger coins. See if you can make it work with a ten-cent coin. See you again next week. Goodbye.